What up? Spite in the house. <coughs> About to open some mail. Death metal is forever. What do you think that could be? <coughs> oh, a little hairy there. Well, the hair was tucked into my koozie. What's up, everybody? How was your Monday? Hmm. No, Dave. Hey. Bomber. Yes, you're right. It is the barbecue time. Mutilation barbecue, how death metal, you know. Tape by Gurgling Gore. <clears throat> I got some t shirts with um, the album art still. Um, so you can hit them up. Um, and yeah <coughs> it's good shit playing next month with this fine gentleman here Dave Kirsch from Noxus headlining the Ohio Death Fest with Noxus and uh, well at one point this was going to be that was going to be like their first show but they snuck a couple in before that. But if you're in within an hour of uh, Young Sound or a few hours if you're really willing to drive. You know, if you're in Cleveland, if you're in Akron, if you're in Pittsburgh, even, even Columbus, Toledo, some parts of West Virginia. I mean, Dark Druid, they're coming up from Kentucky, so come on out. It's a killer lineup. It's going to be a good time. Tenebris, ten, tenebris, tenebris. Aberrations from Texas. Raul. Supposed to send them some uh, funeral vomit tapes for this. I kind of forget what he was supposed to be sending me. Aha, I just saw him post about it. Corpse. Till, till death, till you rot. Very original. Uh, I'm not sure if this is like um, an older band. <coughs> or, you know. A newer band trying to be older. Ah, it is old. 93. Oh, yeah. Well, some of you Texas people probably know these guys then. Texas death metal. Pair with. 
with the Ohio, <clears throat> Texas old Ohio new. Unfortunately, this is just personal. I didn't get any of these for distro, so the band got them. I don't know if they put them up for sale. And I don't know if GG still got them, but <clears throat> that's where to look. I'm sure some other dishes did get them. But these corpse tapes will be going up in the distro shortly. Corpse Till Death Till You Rot 93 demo Texas Death Metal. Here's the package from Sewer Rot that I've been waiting for a while. They always have the worst luck whenever they send me shit. And uh, I guess I guess USPS flagged it as non-media mail, just for having some stickers and shit with it. They opened it up and shit, and then instead of just sending it back though, they just held on to it until you looked into it. And then he was able to get it back and resend it. But we got some really cool shit in here. <coughs> we got the unembalmed CDs. We got the mortuary spawn tapes. We got cryptum CDs. Mortuary Spawn CDs. The um, those charn the charnel grounds CDs and reeking CDs. Throwing it back to one of the first sewer rot releases. Yeah, um, <clears throat> I think, uh, I think it was Ian that told me about these guys at first. Said something about, um, trying to release them, and I was like, well, I think, uh, I think they're already covered, dude. But yeah, I definitely would have loved to release that. It's a good one. UK UK death metal over there with like uh, slime lord and all of them yeah I got a good stack of CDs from sewer rot only one uh, title on tape and uh, <clears throat> I thought I was supposed to get some charnel grounds tapes maybe they're not ready yet I can't remember the whole stipulation, but we go side B, spite, winds of Luciferian ether live in Brooklyn, New York. So yeah, I got a little promotion going on this week. I might try to do this like every week. Something something new maybe. <clears throat> try to do a different kind of promotion every week. Like uh, this week it's buy an, one LP. Get a 7 inch for free. It's a pretty good deal. Um, and that goes through Friday. It ends Saturday, November 6th. Um, and then maybe next week I'm going to do something like buy a t shirt, get a free CD, you know? Buy a CD, get a tape half off, some shit like that, you know? 
Hello from Texas. We were just talking about Texas. Anyways, the that's a. I don't know if I've seen that yet. They put like the little a little band photo on the ink imprint. <clears throat> it's kind of different. I never really would have thought to do that, honestly. And um, it's not that bad. It's not just like super blurred or anything. Yeah, you know. Giving them away for free. Ultra Ready Spawn. Uh, this thing don't ever focus when I want it to. Focus. Anyway. Huh. Very happy looking lads, actually. Like it. This, um. Uh, Inoculation tour shirt from a tour that I did not see them at, and it was really cheap like 10 bucks. You know, can't beat that for a shirt, really. At that point, the band's just trying to break even, you know. So, anyway, it's a white shirt. Don't usually buy white shirts because I tend to stain them, and uh, stained it. So, tie dyed it to cover up stains, you know. Oh, all these new CDs to blast in the car, though. I'm I'm happy I got this CD because I bought that benefit T-shirt for them when uh, the one dude got in the fire or whatever. And uh, but I never got their tape, so now. Shout out Hostel Records. Shout out Impure. Shout out Inoculation. Actually, I'm all inocked out right now. Check out my boys on tour with Frozen Soul, Sangle Sugar Bug. And who else is playing on that? Mm, I don't know. I forget. Anywho. That's the stacks. For distro. Today, at least. I don't really have a lot more incoming at the moment, though. Jeez. Some dudes. I got I got a lot of new CDs for the car lately. We got a, like a tower of them over there that I still gotta go through and play. Yeah, this shit's pretty crazy, the charnel grounds. Pretty uh, different from the other sewer rot stuff, I guess. 
maybe. Ian, do you do their layouts? No, you don't. What up, Aaron? Kyle Messick does their layouts. I don't know the way. The way the back of these CD layouts are really reminds me of yours, Ian. Yeah. All uh, safe and sound. Hi, Steph. And Krypton, uh, I don't have this tape either, so I'm excited to get this one because <coughs> I remember when these guys did that uh, sewer rock stream, I was pretty impressed with them. <laughs> sewer rock can't afford you, huh? Yeah, I don't know, do you know Kyle at all? I'm, uh, friends with him on Facebook. He buys shit from me every once in a while. Cool dude. Never really talked to him though. Yeah. Thank you. I'm getting good compliments on the tie down. So yeah guys, that's it. Watch for that stuff on the store soon. We'll see you later. <laughs>